So here we go. Um, I am heterosexual. So yes, I am heterosexual. Sorry. Um, what can I do? Who does that? Nice. Nobody. Well, I feel like coming out for gay guys is oh, unfair. Because the heterosexual people don't do that. They don't need to go to the parents and say like, you know, I am heterosexual. No, they don't do that. Just they don't. But people, gay people, we need to do that in order to just be... It's a big deal. Um, so I uh, will try to do faster. Uh Toto here. My coming up video. This could be fun. So I always knew that I'm gay. Um, too gay for my country, Bolivia, Cochabamba. Uh, dealing with a lot of bullies, you know, like I don't even care. So I was pretty much playing the game that if they call me marica or queer or whatever, I was being more queer and marica than I can be. So that wasn't a problem. Well, it was later on, but that's why I moved to US. So my coming out to my mom was actually when I was living here in US and I was talking to her on the phone. Um, and she noticed something in my voice and she asked me like, what's going on? So I thought that was the perfect time to me to tell her. So, so I just came up very easy and said that, that I feel depressed because I'm lonely. And she said that I shouldn't find a girlfriend. And then I told her like, mom, you know who I am. And that was it. And she said, like, yes, I knew, I know. And, like, she just said, oh, well, I just don't care. Um, I just wanted to see you happy and uh, be careful and just be happy, be you, you know? I never have a problem with my mom when I was growing up. She always gave me a very freedom to do whatever I wanted to do, um, dress up, dancing in my you know, room, anything, or like being flamboyant all the time. It was fun. With my brothers that I have two, I was dealing a little bit because of the bullying of school. Uh, they were also bullying them because they have a brother, a queer brother, and they couldn't handle the bullying all the time, so they were fighting with me. Uh, mostly the second one, the younger second, I am the oldest. Um, when I told her I was scared in the US and we were talking on the phone and I told him that I'm gay and he started crying. I thought that was very sweet. And he started crying and saying that, you know, I'm sorry because I was one of them that I was bullying you and blah, 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 blah. So I don't have any, re any hate or anything against him. So I told him that's in the past, so move forward. And that was it. That was very simple. I have a very lovely brother. Uh, with the second one, the youngest one, uh, that was more fun because I came out very strong with the with with my second brother. I thought the baby need to be more. Um, I have to be more careful. So I told him that I need to talk to him and something like. And he was like, "What? What's going on?" And I was like, I'm gay. And he was like, oh, okay, wow. I thought you were sick or something. So <laughs> that was it. And I, he was like, it's cool, I don't care. Uh, you know, just be happy, be you. So I have a beautiful family. I have the best time with them, um, up and downs like any family, but we love each other and we support each other and I have the best support ever. So that was it. Um, I don't have relationship with my dad. That's the best thing I hear, I think. So I don't care not to have a connection with my dad because I know for a fact that my dad is homophobic. So for me, like growing up with my mom and my brothers was the best thing in my gay life because 
I will pretty much be able to be myself all the time. Now, dealing with society was different. I have a lot of, you know, bullying growing up. But I love that because I am who I am now because of that. And thank you guys for hating me so much and bullying me so much and make me so strong that now I embrace it every day and I'm very happy being this Marika. So um, I hope you like this video. And if I can contribute with something as my coming out story. So uh, my contribution for um, the coming out stories could be that you need to know who you are and just embrace uh, who you are. And you don't need to like come out of the closet to everyone. If you want to share your story with someone like your family that is important uh, or your support system is fine, but you don't need to come out to the world. Uh, heterosexual people don't come up, don't go to their families and say that, oh, mom, by the way, I am heterosexual. Never happen and never will. Um, so I feel like it's unfair for a gay guy to come up like that. But if you want to share like I do uh, with the world, well, say that I am very happy homosexual.